Hello, and welcome to Generic Nintendo YouTuber watches the Indie World for free content, where I, your resident Generic Nintendo YouTuber, watches the Indie World for free content. Maybe we'll finally get some Silk Song. <laughs> you know, I actually really like Indie Worlds. They always show off uh, at least like a couple of cool games. I also don't really care for everything. I mean, it's the Indies. You know, um, always something new to play. I have nothing to say for the intro, and I'm tired. America. Oh, here we go. Ooh. Oh, there's no M-rated games. It's cussing. Um, maybe I'm just an idiot, but I'm pretty sure this is actually a new animation. Uh, but, you know. Uh, this is like that one game that I can't remember the name of. It, 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 getting some vibes. I don't remember the name. I don't even remember who made it. I think it was on the Xbox or Dream Dreamcast. But, yeah, all right. Uh, it basically just looks exactly like that. All right, that looks like it could be uh, pretty good, you know? Oh my gosh, I love games that have this kind of art style. I love, oh my gosh. Is this like a puzzle game? I don't know. Um, oh, it looks, I really like the art style. It's pretty good. Oh boy. I mean, yeah, obviously there are a few like rough spots, but it's an indie game. You're not allowed to complain about that stuff. Oh yeah, I'm totally getting this game. It looks, looks, it looks pretty good. Okay, well, you lost my interest in there. Um, all right, Loop Hero, Devolver Digital. Hmm. I I've heard good things about Studio, but you know. Oh. Okay. Okay, that's actually really. That's a really fun idea. Oh, that is such a cool idea. All right. I've never heard of that game before, but this looks pretty cool. Oh, is it a sequel game? Is it a sequel game? Yeah, okay, it is a sequel. Never heard of the original. This looks like it could be, uh, you know, it could be all right, you know? Uh, not a big fan of this art style, but okay. Okay, but like, what's the actual gameplay? Um, oh, oh, so it's, it's already out. Stealth drops are always cool. Oh uh, yeah, this one, I, I, I remember this one. You know, I, I kept saying I'll play it, but then I never played it unless it isn't out. I don't know. I, I, like I wanted to play it. Okay, so it didn't come. I, I um, you know, I wanted to play Axiom Verge. I never got around to it. Okay, cool. I ain't playing it until I play the first one. Obviously, don't spoilers. Ooh. What? Oh, cool. Puzzle. It's like a mobile game on Switch. Listen, I might be in the minority here. I think Shovel Knight is just a little overrated. Like it's good and all. I just don't think it's that good. And saying that, not really sure if uh, something I would be interested in. It doesn't, in my opinion, it doesn't look very good. It, it just kind of looks like a mobile game. Like it looks, like, looks good, I, I guess. Like visually it's good, but I don't know how unpopular's opinion is. This doesn't look very good in my opinion. N not playing it. No. Good for the people who uh, want to play it. Oh, oh, I, I like diorama type stuff too, you know. Console edition. So like a game on PC or mobile? I don't know. I don't really keep up with indie games that much. Pretty much indie world's my only exposure to indie games. Unfortunately. Uh... Okay. Maybe. Uh, hmm. I don't know. I'd have to uh, look into this a bit more before you're saying like, I'll play it. Oh hey, uh, visuals are neat. Yeah, it doesn't really look like it's my thing, but cool for fans of the Metal Slug series, I guess. But for me, not really. Wait, Tetris Effect is an indie game. What? I didn't. I didn't even know that. What? It's an, it's an indie game? How did I not know that? I guess I just 
Don't look into things. I, I know. I know. I know what Tetris effect is. I. I know. Sorry, I'm gonna be playing Metroid on that day. Sorry. All right. Looks like it could be. Looks like it could be good. You know. I'd say that most of the uh, ones that I'm interested in were definitely in the first half, but you know, as an indie world, about about average. Or is Breath of the Wild too?